What's up, guys? Ben Jeter here, representing Bevan the Court, and we're back with another video. Today, we're covering AntStream. Not sure if you guys ever heard of AntStream. It's pretty much a place you play retro arcade games. So, pretty much, AntStream Arcades is a retro games platform with over a thousand games to choose from. I mean, there's a lot, man. You can play across consoles. Now, last time I checked, this wasn't on consoles yet. Maybe plan on doing it. But yeah, phones, tablets, all that stuff. Anything that has an app and you can stream it. This is pretty much it, man. It has like uh, challenges, tournaments, all that good stuff. But today we're gonna mess around with this, show you guys a little bit of what it is and what it can do. It's awesome, man. You guys know I love arcade games, so this is a huge plus for me. So let's uh, mess around with a few things. All right. So at the top, you see like a little header, whatever's going on here. Uh, they show the tournaments. Also, guys, uh, I recommend using the Xbox controller. Well, there's an Xbox, Xbox 360, Xbox One, or Xbox Series controller. Any of those would be great. Now, you can use something else, but it's something that, you know, they recommend. And, uh, yeah, I recommend as well. But, yeah, you can use PlayStation controller, Nintendo, all that good stuff, too. All right, but, yeah, this is a streaming service. So let you guys know. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'll have the link in the description. Check this out. It has a little bit of everything. This are their top picks right here. They have, like, literally thousands of games, so I can't sit here and go through all of them. But one thing I like about, as you see right there, uh, let you know who made it or where it's from, Warner Brothers. The year it came out, 83, for this game right here, Spy Hunter. Spy Hunter's pretty hard. I mean, pretty old. And it's hard, too. The genre and all that good stuff. But, yeah, I'm on a controller right now. Uh, Star Wars, Space Invaders, Asteroids. Like, this is a lot of old stuff. A lot of good stuff, man. Like, for you retro guys. Even Earthworm Gem. I didn't expect Earthworm Gem to be here because I never played in arcades before. So, that's a plus right there. Maybe we got Metal Slug. So, you guys know you love Metal Slug and all that good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so I did try one game out, which was Mortal Kombat. And uh before I get to the games, let me show you some soap at the top. So uh matter of fact we do it now, maybe we're down here. <laughs> games with challenges. So these games right here, this pretty much show you all the games that had like challenges. Uh like a daily challenge. I think they're I think they're gonna do my weekly. Let me double check, let me click on Patman real quick. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me, uh, okay, here we go. Try exclusive challenges, win challenges to earn gems, unlock more challenges. We'll be adding new challenges regularly. So that constantly be doing these. These are, these are the challenges right here. Uh, you get the, okay, right now, one of the challenges is the time attack one, best score, medal you can get, current position, top three. So this has one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh my, more than that. Seven, eight is a lot, so you can lock more, I guess. Yeah, so they will have challenges to keep you busy. Uh, scores so you can have the top scores guys across the world who played this this has actually been around for a while i just learned about this maybe a few months ago i thought it was like yeah i think it was like beginning of the year maybe january or you know late last year but yeah so there's a lot of a lot of stuff on here to keep you busy keep you occupied and pretty much you go to similar tab and show you the games are similar which i don't understand why more the comments down there and of course we have the regular section of the info you can play the game you can share it you can start as one of your favorites uh, but let's go up here real quick. You can search wherever you want. Popular searches by platforms. You can just highlight those, click on those. Uh, they're also alphabetical. So we have the zero to nine. The only game is zero to nine. The A to B, you know, it's, it's a lot of games, a thousand. So I, I refuse to scroll down to show you guys all that, but more reasons for you guys to actually, you know, test it out. There's a free trial, uh, mode too. And yeah, I think you guys should definitely try it out, man. I think they like it, especially if you love retro games and, Want to play arcade games at home without actually having to get the, you know, the hardware. This is, this is a really great way to do it. All right. And this is your user. So you have your user. I have a thousand ten rubies. I don't know how I got that. Probably because I played more to comment for a little bit to test it out. Big more to comment, guys. So I had to check it out. So it shows your top three genres too, whatever you play the most. Mine is versus. So I only did one game. You have achievements. 25. I have one so far. Challenges, one or loss. So if you try to do the challenges, whether you win or lose them, I guess that show. I've never seen them like that before. <laughs> but yeah. So the amount of games it has right there is 1,203. 1203. So I played one. So that shows you how much you guys want to know the exact number right there. We have 1203. Uh, yeah, then it shows your uh, challenges haven't done any yet. Your social. So um, yeah, this is where you can see your ant stream buddies or find some new ones from existing social networks. So I don't have any yet because this is my first time I'm trying this out. You can add people. Probably easier hooking up to Facebook. In the beginning, I was, you know, given the option to uh, sync my Facebook, but I just, you know, just did my email instead. 
Uh, and your favorites, of course, the stuff you star, which I haven't started any yet. All right, what we have over here is the achievements you get. And, of course, there are a lot of achievements. I have one so far. I played one game session. They seem pretty easy. I guess. think you get the rubies from that. Yeah, that's where I got my first thousand points from. So, yeah, there's a lot of these. You can look through these if you want. You know, we get it, of course. Play 100 game sessions. That's a lot, man. <laughs> that's a lot. All right, up top here, we have messages. So, that's pretty cool. You can message people. That's, that's, that's pretty hot. I didn't expect that. And tournaments. Like, just tournaments. This is a really good feature right here. You can join tournaments. They have, like, these are online tournaments, of course. This start 23 days. Oh, it started already, but it has 23 days left. So, we have elevator action. We have Pac-Man tournament. I know a lot of you older people like Pac-Man. <laughs> you know, I never was a big fan of Pac-Man, but, yeah. A lot of you little older guys are going to uh, gonna be digging that Pac-Man. Metal Slug actually has a tournament, which is crazy. It ended on July 6th. I didn't even know. I just started today. I wish I knew. I would have jumped on that. You know, Metal Slug is pretty cool. Prehistoric IO. This is all the stuff that ended. This is all the stuff that ended. And it's probably a long list of games. So, yeah, we're just going to go back up. Well, yeah, that's cool. I have the tournaments. Keep you occupied. Give you something to do. Uh, and the settings. Uh, that's my name. I need to ask if you guys want to add me on this. If you guys start playing it, you can change your avatar, which I have the guy from the top right. I'm a fighting game. I'm SK, one of the SK fighting games. I think this is Burning Fight. Not too sure. Uh, and your region, password, all that stuff. Yeah, billing method. I have a subscription. I don't pay for anything. Mine expires October 8th. Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, hopefully I'll be a complete partner after this. I don't have to ever pay for a subscription. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know how much it costs because I didn't, you know, I was I was given this free sub subscri ah, subscription. Talk too fast. Let me slow down for you guys. But yeah, but um, definitely check it out. I have the link there. I really think it's worth it, but let's get back into the games. You guys have seen the most. So since more of the comments here, I'm going to click on that first. Also, the Discord for these guys, too. You want to check it out. Um, I like how the fact it shows a little description of the game and then, you know, the year it came out and all that. Multiplayer, this has two players. Let's you know how many players it has also. All right, let's play this bad boy. Okay, this right here shows you how to play the game. Each game will show you how to play them. Of course, this has block. Uh, the add credits is always the start button. So that's pretty cool. I thought it would be like back or select, but yeah. Uh, this game pad, keyboard. I'm not really using the keyboard. That's just not my style for fighter, so I have no choice. Touch, if you have some type of if you're playing on tablet or something, you have touch uh, features. That's that's pretty cool. Didn't expect that either. That's, that's pretty epic. And instructions, how to play the game. It gives you a little trivia on the side. And uh, that's pretty cool. Trivia, how to play. And uh, yeah, pretty much teach you how to play the game. You can't hold it down. You can't hold it. No, you can't hold it. You just got to keep tapping and it go down and all that. But yeah, that's uh, <laughs> that's the, that's, that's start. All right, let's play. Also, guys, I'm wired. I'm not sure how well it plays wireless, you know. Um, all right, let's do this. This game is legendary, man. <laughs> this game is legendary. Now, you guys, I'm a Bruce Lee guy. But I know a lot of you guys are ninja guys, so I'm a rock with Scorpion. Scorpion. And you can keep adding credits if you want. Everything is like, you know, endless amounts of coins. Just like any arcade emulator you can think of, but this feels better actually. Uh, there isn't a full screen option. This is the full screen. This is what you get. Oh. There we go. It's very responsive too, man. Like it's very responsive, very fluid, no delay, no lag. Everything feels perfect. Now I was checking out for more Mortal Kombat. I was just searching games. This seems to be the only one here. There we go. I was hoping that worked. <laughs> the old memory, man. Easy, this whole block. Tap up, I think, two to three times. Three times. Sweep distance, and you pull that off. Finisher. You only have one finisher in this game for those who are for the first time. This crap is hard. It's been a while since I played this, man. Oh! Come on. There we go. There we go. 
And I'm gonna do a couple rounds of this. I'm gonna switch out and show you something else. Maybe after this Kano fight, I'll switch to something else. If you guys wanna see more of this or any particular game, let me know in the comment section. And I'll uh, do those for these guys. Like, one of you, man. He deserves. I'm gonna burn him. <laughs> he has to get burned. Come on. Oh my god, you got him. Kano, I hate you, man. But yeah, like I said, it's 1200 games. I don't mind covering this multiple times because there's so many games I can cover on this. There we go. We got the uppercut. And I got hit by some type of blue knife. Oh, crap. We're going to lose. Oh, yeah. We're going to lose. Oh, we're going to lose. He ducks there every time. I hate you, Kano. <laughs> All right. Let's jump out of this. Uh, oh, one thing. I forgot to tell you. So the slack button or the back button or an Xbox controller is the little, we're going to call it the two screens. That's how you get out of the game. So the settings, you can go do what you want from the settings to make the uh, D-pad floating or static. Vibration on or off. Transparency, high, medium, low. I got high. D-pad, dead zone, small, medium, large. I have large. That just pretty much was my default. But I did change the transparency. I raised that myself. And you can save it. You have three save states for each game. So say you want to continue left off that's a plus and the how play is right here again too if you guys forget anything but yeah save states is a huge plus especially if you just can't beat something or need to stop and come back later all right let's get out of this all right so already it ranked me i'm um, 3020 of a spot in this game that's cool all right let's get out of this that's uh go back to here all right so i like how they have the games with challenges section right here they have everything sectionized and uh yeah you guys can look to that your heart we even got bubble bobble inspect that metal slug galaga space invaders centipede i don't know who bomb jack is probably older than me we got double dragon that's pretty cool too we got joust i actually have an arcade machine speaking of arcades shout out to AntStream for hooking me up with this subscription to cover this this service of theirs it was awesome with arcade service and I can't wait for it to hit consoles like xbox playstation nintendo switch and all that stuff it would really be awesome i think people would sign up like left and right they did something like that also shout out to rk1 up because they gave me some arcade machines that covers joust and mortal Kombat. and i just got some arcade you guys follow me on social media i'm a facebook fan page of uh, twitter and even my personal facebook and stuff like that i like you know i've been showing my uh, arcades i built recently so yeah big arcade guy i did a street fighter 2 collection it was legacy edition i did a marvelous cat com one and i got a mortal Kombat downstairs so I'm going to build that soon. Looking forward to new ones. This game looks pretty cool. I never heard of this. Let's try this out. It's called. Uh... Let's not try that out. <laughs> it's a title game. But it looks pretty cool though. At least for the art. All right, uh, yeah. So it's a, it's a lot man. Like Metal, Metal Slug X. Bad dudes. I think I had this for the original Nintendo when I was a kid. Soccer. But yeah, it's a lot man. You be sitting here for hours. They got Fit of Fury on here. So we're going to try one of those. But yeah, there's a lot in here. I'm going to try at least a different genre here and there. It got the trending section, the new game section. So they just added this in uh, Pac-Man. And uh, the cool thing about Pac-Man, my mom actually asked me recently about getting her a Pac-Man arcade machine. I may do that, but this can hold her from, you know, for now. I'm going to get her uh, to get the subscription to try this out too. All right, multiplayer games. You know, everything is pretty much laid out easy for you to find everything. It's when they like the interface is really cool, really nice. It doesn't look cheap. It doesn't look. Oh, even got Rampage on here. Let's try Rampage. That 1986 version. Oh boy, <laughs> dude, I didn't even know this game was like been around that long. I was thinking about the N64 one. All right, so we got punch. We got jump. Let's try this. Wow, Rampage is this old? That's crazy. George, Lizzie, Ralph, R8. Uh, let's, let's go. I'm George. I didn't get to pick my guy. Looks like I'm a George. All right. But yeah, I definitely enjoyed the uh, N64 one. That was like legendary. How did I come up with this? Can I... Is he shooting at me? Wait a second. Come here. There we go. You get eight today. Can I climb up this? There we go. We going. Got him. Yo, this is crazy. The movie was not like this. <laughs> George was like the bad guy but he was uh no, no george was the good guy my bad he was he was a good guy can i come on this side of the building yes there we go 
Okay, that was bad. I'm not sure if you could stomp on them, like before. No, it doesn't seem like there's an option to do that. Alright, so one other thing I noticed too, is like super old. Like, you can't move from side to side. I'm just stuck here. <laughs> there's nowhere else to go. And I'm assuming we just destroy everything until it breaks down. Yeah, I've never played this arcade version of Rampage before. Ever. This is the first time for me. It's crazy. Eat that and see what happens. Dude, I just knocked some out of the building. <laughs> Yo. Just noticed, dude, just like flying out of his window. He just eating these guys. Goodbye. And I got hurt by that? Definitely did. It's supposed to be the end of stage. Yeah. Alright. This is how this game's set up. I'm over there trying to run down the street. Doesn't work that way. Man, this makes me want to play the N64 one, man. I mean, this is pretty cool, though. Like, look. No uh, no lag, no nothing. It feels perfect like I'm playing like from a console or something. This is awesome. I'm digging it. Get out of here. Man, it makes me think, like, why do I buy arcade machines? <laughs> I just do this. It's simpler, much easier. But then again, I love arcade machines, so yeah, it's a given. I have gaming events, like, every year, so, like, having arcades is, like, the best part of it. They look forward to come here, trying the new arcades I get. Got, like, at least three right now, three new ones. I'm gonna add some more. What is it? You got damaged again? Dude, you better die. See if I can at least break down one more building before it's like game over. You about to die. There we go. Is that it? <laughs> He's just looking at the screen the whole time. All right, let's jump out of this. Don't put too much time in this. But yeah, like I say, guys, if uh, if there's a game, specific game you want me to cover, you want to see something, let me know. I'll make another vi video. All right, what else we have here? We have uh, are these arcade adventure games? We got Ninja Game. 1987. Oh, that looks bad. <laughs> oh, whoa, what was that? Hold up, go back to this. What was this? Soul Divide? 1997. That's how it looks. Nah, not too bad. All right, we got driving games. We don't, I didn't see Outrunning anywhere. We got Spy Hunter, though, which is pretty old. We got Wheels. Do like Hulk Hogan a little bit. Red and Yellow. Some cab game. I don't see Paperboy around here. That's one of the games I think should be on here. I don't see California Dreams, but that probably would just, you know, straight console game. Platform games. We got Wibble Bobble. We got Joe and Mac. We got Earthworm Gem. We got a lot of everything, man. Now, I noticed there Simpsons isn't on here. Um, oh, I love the beat em up section, man. So we got Double Dragon. TMNT isn't on here, and X Men isn't on here. If you guys are wondering if those are here. But most likely they'd probably come. We got Double Dragon. We got Ninja Gaiden. Ninja Gaiden, man. That's like retro, dude. Uh, Gang Wars. We got a lot of stuff here. Racing games, sports games. You got the baseball all stars, baseball stars from um S and K. Man, it's, it's just a lot, man. Pinball games. Wow, I didn't know that we had pinball games. We got fight sim games. We got casino games. We have our right, back to adventure and uh Shooting and stuff like that. So we've been already fighting games. We had Pit Fighter, this back that Cinema Showdown, Fit of Fury, Art of Fighting, Karate Champ. I don't know what that is. More Fit of Fury, Shadow Forest, uh, more Art of Fighting, Street Smart, more Fit of Fury. It's uh, dude, it's just so much King of the Monsters. This is back that. There's a lot on here, man. It just, sheesh, it's like so much strategy, role playing games, like. X Avenger games. It's a lot, man. It is a lot. I didn't expect an RPG to be on here. Like, this is an arcade game. We got some Pokemon game right here. It's like, <laughs> oh, Poco, whatever you want to call it. That's, uh, Strive Fit of Fury. It's 1991 one. So, I'm going to cover a couple more games. And then that'll be it. And, like I said, if you guys want to see more games running on this streaming service, this streaming platform, let me know. And uh, by the time I do the next video, I'll let you guys know if, if I've seen it on PlayStation or Xbox or anything like that. Or if one of you guys go there first and you see Ant Stream on one of these console games, let me know. 
in the comment section. I'd be much, it would be much appreciated. All right, let's beat Ducky up because he's an annoying character. Those they don't have any King of Fighter games yet. They do have Fit of Fury one, two special. I didn't see three. Art Fighting one and two is on here. Savage Rain is on here, I think. Okay, this way you jump back and forth. Hold on, dude. Here we go. <laughs> Enough of that. Everyone has that move, yo. Like, everyone has that move. Ah! Come on, dude. He keeps, like, jumping lanes. There we go. Stop jumping lanes. This is 1991. This look that bad for 1991 fighter. Definitely does it. Of course, it's, you know, very old looking, but I don't think it's that bad. That's pretty cool. This guy right here, man. How do you do your... Uh, there we go. Power wave. Oh, my God. He's on my heart. And I'm dazed. Duck King, you are my friend. The worst character in the game. Ah, he got me. I'm more of a Ryo Sakazaki guy. So, you know, I run with Ryo Sakazaki. I run by the King of Fighters. I did notice right there, though, with, like, whenever the screen gets dark or dims, whatever, it kind of gets blurry for a second. But for the most part, it's all good. We gotta beat this guy. We can't lose a Duck King. Ah, this guy, dude, he's annoying. There we go. Oh, wait. Ah, uh -huh. the amount of damage this does back then. It's like how the first Street Fighter game was, man. That Hadouken that Ryu did, you pulled it off. Did a lot of damage. All right, let's switch out of this. I want to try uh, Artifact. I should have did like the second Fit of Fury. But I definitely want to try, uh, well, I'm already on here. 986, so not many people playing this right now. I mean, it's still a big number. But I definitely want to try uh, Art of Fighting. You got some showdown. Order fighting two was that a pit fighter man? I've never had pit fighter for Sega Genesis as a kid, like long, long time ago. Hold oh, wait a sec, what did I say? Okay, so this storyline was set in motion from Fate of Fury two. I never knew that. Yeah, they, they're in the same area, South Town. Uh, these games coexist with each other. That's Fate of Fury, King of Fighters. Yuri Sakazaki, which isn't fight yet. That's, that's, that was Yuri, guys. Right, we got Ryo Sakazaki, Robert King, Tim Jin, A.G. Kisaragi, John Big, Mickey. Oh crap, he's going too fast. Oh, Yuri does fight. One of the Fit of Fury games too. Uh, I don't remember which one it was. Lee Pai Long. It had. It could have been special, I think. But it had Ryo from. Uh, you know, of course, out of fighting on there with the Fate of Fury guys. That was pretty cool. Round one. one thing I didn't like about the Art of Fighting games, like, the characters were so big, man. It's my guy right here, though. Ryo Sakazaki. Well, how do you do the, uh... Oh, I think it's how you do it. That's not how you do it. Hold on. No, it's not how you do it. The only thing is, Ryo was like one of my favorite characters in SNK, like period, like of all time. But I never really cared too much about his art of fighting games. Like I played them, but just I don't know. I like him better in the King Fighter games. He stopped that out of the air. He definitely did. Here we go, the jab right in his stomach. Dude, look at my face. The battle damage is real in this. Guys, this is playing like flawlessly, man. I do this all again. There we go. They got me thrown, trying to be cool. I don't think you can change the difficulty too. I didn't see an option to do that. So you'll have the basic level four or norm for like most of these games you see in arcades. Oh, got him! Oh, but he was dazed. 
I thought he was the East. I was trying to do something cool to him. Oh, man. This is hot, though. All right, let's get out of this. I want to do at least one more, two more for this, and then we call it quits. Let's see. I'm having too much fun right now. Uh, Let's do... Semi showdown. See how that runs. 1993. We got semi showdown on here. I can't wait to see what games they add next. I'm gonna get my boy Haomaru. He's he's a main. Actually, Galfer's my guy, but I'll run Haomaru since we're doing this little quick video. And then, like I said, if you guys want to see other games played on here, let me know. There's 1,200 games on here. There's a lot. But I'll do it either upload. Or a stream you guys want to see more in uh, depth with it. Some questions as we're doing it. We got that, we got that. Axe Buns at the bottom. Let's go, Goffer. I like how it's the blood versions too. It's not like the dumbed down, edited. Sensor version with like bit comes out of them. Home Wait, home net. Someone that. <laughs> it's like that. Okay, hear him that clearly. Oh, Galfer. Crap, he really had. He really got away from that. Funny thing is, guys, I showed my girl from this, right? And she doesn't really play retro games like that. And the moment she seen it interface, and she was like, oh, this looks cool. I want to try it out. And I just started showing the games I was playing, and she was sold, man. Like I say, just crap. These arcade games, man, it's something about magic. It just has, like, magic to it, man. Like, I, I remember I uh, built my two arcade machines. And my two kids came in. Yeah, I have kids. And they're real small, though. Like, four years old. But um, yeah, they saw it and they just couldn't take their eyes off of it. They wanted to play so bad, so I let them play it. And I'm like, I didn't think they can play it. Like they're, they're small. What can they do with this? Put them on the stool, let them try, and they play Final Fight. I let them put it on so both can play together. And then I leave. I left the room. I went downstairs. Came back like maybe 20 minutes later. And they nah, all right, maybe longer than that. <laughs> but they beat the game. It's crazy. They, they beat Final Fight. Now, of course, it's free play. You can keep putting the amount of coins you want in or credits. You want to call it credits. Uh, yeah, it was pretty cool, man. It's like, reminds me of when I was young again. And I was that small. Like, how we were. We in arcades. We just, we loved that place, man. It sucks that kids nowadays only have that. I mean, there's still some arcades around, but it's not as many. And they were a big thing back then. Like, back then, if you wanted the best graphics, you went to an arcade. That's why, um, didn't need my bad to Mike. That's why the Neo Geo console calls so much because it was like it's crazy. Sega, Super Nintendo had okay graphics, but they just couldn't do what arcades were doing at the time. All right, so I'm gonna try Metal Slug out real quick. Try the first one, that'll be the last game we try today. And that'll be it, man. I want you guys to let me know what you think of this, man. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Hope you guys plan on trying this out. You don't have to worry about trying to find emulators or trying to find games or anything illegal or anything like that you can just get this little service stream it on your iphone your android device your uh your tablets and consoles when they're available on consoles i'm gonna double check after this because the moment of recording this there weren't any apps on the consoles weren't any at all but man it's, it's perfect though it's like no lag nothing it just look at them pigs man what's wrong with you it's another classic um, series. Grab a hand over there. Thank you. Thank you. Got him. I think most people love Metal Slug. Most people. It's rare to find. Oh, it's the, the trash version with the spit. Thank you. Ain't blood, man. What is this? Not gonna lie, at first I was like, man, I seen that uh, it was like one player, no multiplayer. I was like, what? You can't have these games on multiplayer. But I guess it meant no multiplayer online. I'm like, all right, all right. <laughs> you can't have arcades and no two-player co-op? That's a no-go. We need that.
Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, we got Mari in it. So had the frame dips. <laughs> this, this is how the original one is, too, guys. So don't think it's something with the game. The game just been so much going on on the screen one time. Frame rate start. Uh, okay. You got from buddy. That's all you got. Be shooting arcade. I mean, arcades. <laughs> Don't do much into what I'm doing right now. You shooting like uh bombs? There we go. Oh, this is about to be going. Is this the boss for the stage? Or is like some mini? It must be the boss. It's still here. Blow it up. Party out. That was it. That was pretty quick. I got uh, how many? Four guys I saved this time. <laughs> all right guys this is the end of the video the end of it hope you guys liked it i know a lot of you guys probably don't know what this is it's probably your first time checking it out but definitely definitely do check it out like i think it's amazing to have especially with all the features i, had. I didn't know it was gonna have these features i thought it'd just be like you know you got your selection of games that's it it has online tournaments it has leaderboards it has challenges it has achievements it's just a lot that just came with in 1200 games 1200 plus games man that was a lot man they weren't lying about that and it just plays perfectly like you know i did quality did dip a little bit even though i'm wired in so i don't know if that was just me or just the time of day with his maintenance right now i don't know but i'm using a wireless controller i'm not even wired in and it just it's great man <laughs> i love arcade games so this is pretty cool and i'm glad that they reached out to me to cover this Hopefully I get partnered with these guys and continue to, you know, update you guys on this. I'll have the link in the description below for you guys to check it out yourself. Go to the website. Also, there is, like I say, there is a trial. So you guys can just test it out. See if you like it. Most likely you're going to like it, though. Even for guys who aren't really arcade fans or the newer generation who are young right now who didn't really experience the stuff back then, I think you guys enjoy it, too. Like I said, my girlfriend, she came in here and she was like, you know, she would normally play something like this. And the moment I showed her just this right here, she was like, oh, wow, this looks cool. Can I play with you? You know, so, yeah, it's really good to have with family and friends. And uh, it's great, man. Oh, the game of the month. I think I'm going to try this Pac-Man tournament, though. <laughs> anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Um, be sure to like the video, turn on notifications if you guys are new to the channel. Sub to the channel if you are new to the channel. And uh, let me know in the comment section what games you like, what games you plan on trying. Like, they got Star Wars, man. That's crazy. Yeah, a lot of those in here. Man, that's crazy. <laughs> but as always, guys, take care, stay safe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.